All right, guys, we're taking a look at another Rush Duel deck. We have the Dark Sword Magician. Mostly worried about its first effect if the number of face up level 7 higher, higher monsters on your opponent's field exceeds the number of monsters on your field. So that's any monster on your field. You can special summon this card from your hand. So it's a pretty, uh, pretty. It's like a comeback. It's like a comeback mechanic. So if your opponent's broken your field and has a heavy monster, you draw into this immediately. It's an immediate comeback. You get a normal summon them immediately. Now it has a continuous effect where if you have six or more spell cards in your graveyard, it can't be destroyed by your opponent's card effects. You only have total seven uh, spell cards, so you don't get that all too often. But you really need the ratio to be mostly monsters. Anyway, we've snuck in a seven roads magician because we're using his equivalent of like dark magician girl he has the seven roads witch and that's seven one card from your hand special summon one level seven or higher dark attribute spellcaster type monster from your hand face up to the field if you special summon seven roads she gains 2k or 400 sorry or no, seven road. Yeah, this card gains 400. So uh, she's pretty much the Dark Magician girl of the seven roads. And then we got this random Dark Sword Magician. But we got a lot of new cards from the box he was in. So it's Light Sorcerer of Sanctity. It was a structure deck. So uh, you're for sure getting these cards. This one's really good. You just pay 300, target a face up monster your opponent controls. It loses attack equal to the number of face up light attribute type spellcasters times 300 till the end we don't have many i think all of them are in this deck all the light spellcaster monsters are in this deck they don't go very far shining shaman target level four or lower spellcaster they can attack directly you don't use that too often this guy's a light spellcaster he's 1400 now we got the new legend, Shield and Sword, which is attack and defense. Very simple. It even works for your monsters, though, so you gotta be careful. Magic Curtain. I got it prismatic, too. Special summon a spellcaster monster from your hand. This turn, that special summon monster cannot be destroyed by trap card effects. It's actually really good. You pay a thousand life points to do it. Another easy way to get this magician out. Or you can, uh, pretty much any card, really. So, uh,. Very, very good addition. And then, of course, we have Widespread Ruin, which just wins you duels overall. Uh, easy claps with this. We're using Hammer hammer Crush Deal. So we do have Hammer Crush. When you have Hammer Crush, you can set it, then draw a card. And you do have to discard a card to use Hammer Rush. So the skill pretty much lets you use it for free. It's really cool stuff. Easy claps. You'll see in the replays, and you'll likely see in live duels. So I hope you guys enjoy, and thanks for watching. All right, here we are facing a Cassidy. We're going second. Looks like 40 cards. Sure is. No sleeve or mats anywhere ever to be seen, which is weird around these rush duels. It's got the bubbly elf and pretty basic cards. But he's got this new card. Very good card. The ultimate flag mech ace breaker. He's gonna lower his attack by 2200. Shaman's gonna make it so he can attack directly. I don't think that's gonna matter. Magic Curtain for the Seventh Road Magician. 2400. Here's the Dark Magician Girl. We're over the 2200, thank goodness. And we break his field. But our field's nothing too, too crazy. He should be able to do something about it. Uh, Palace Gargoyle into Royal Rebel Growl. Wow, he's still going. And then the Dion Keto Boogie Master. Not a huge deal. Oh, Sword and Shield. So even with our Dark Magician Girl on the field, she's still going to get crippled by that. Lower even more. Probably didn't need both. Probably didn't need to use, or no, we didn't need to use both Sword and Shield and uh, this guy. Or we didn't need both, but uh, we had a 2500 monster then we could have just got away with light sorcerer but we did we did need both so uh there you go both both sword and shield and uh, his effect anyway he he's doing something he got out another 2500 monster but widespread ruin there to ruin him he doesn't even want to scoop we obviously had more plays so i'm going to stop it just the dark magician and finish it even in the next generation of duels 
Dark Magician is still just normal summoning and finishing games. Great, great stuff, guys. Alright, here we are facing another Yugo. We're going first. This is generally a second turn deck, but we can go first, no problem. Looks like 40 cards over there for our boy. And we have the Magic Curtain to bring out the Sword. Sword and Shield, no less, too. So there's the Magic Curtain. And we just call it there. He sets three. We're gonna magic curtain again, this time the dark mid oh no, sorry, this time the road witch. Then we bring out the dark magician girl. Swing, swing, swing. Three set monsters. This guy once again gets a three set of monsters, but sets a back row. Now we have Hammer Crush, you get to see the skill. We set the card, flip it up, discard one, destroy that back row. Uh, weird, we threw that away. We could have thrown away one of her, but that's okay. It was a bluff anyway. We swing over all these monsters, and the duel keeps on going. Finally missed a monster this time. We're gonna Hammer Crush once again, pop. Then we get a cutscene for our little Seven Roads Magician. You believe this guy? Then we go Shining Shaman into Seven Roads Witch. Probably should have just special summoned him so she could gain 2k, but it doesn't really make a difference. In for 2500. I buffed him up and swung with him first because I was afraid of the amount of defense on the card he set. Uh, Flame Champion, Widespread Ruin, marks his Dark Sword Magician of his own. Hammer Crush once again, so we should be pretty close to six spell cards. That's one, two, three, four, five, six. We are at six, so we cannot be destroyed by card effects as we swing with him. But the duel is already over, as you can see. Great, great stuff, guys. Alright, here we are facing a Gavin. He's going six. Sec or we're going second, and that's good because this is, in fact, second turn deck. So we got the Hammer Crush. We got the Dark Sword Magician. We're going second. This is what we want. I think I messed this up. Because here, at this point, we would be able to special summon our uh, Dark Sword Magician. We have no monsters. He has a seven. We can special summon it. Kind of messed it up. We go Sword and Shield. I still could have special summoned him. I blow my monsters, not that they are huge amounts of damage, but still, could have done a much better field, could have had those two monsters still out. But again, not a huge deal. He's got these new ultimate monsters, doesn't do much though. Man, look at that, we're, we're gonna use two magic curtains, really lowering our life points, but we can take it, and we have a widespread ruin to fall back on. Dark Sword Magician and his Dark Magician girls. They put the barrier on her, but she's still going to win by 100. Then we're just 100 off a lethal. Super brutal. But not much he's going to be able to do. Although, you know, it's crazy to see them just draw 5. Because there is no top deck mode. You're always drawing 5. But Widespread Ruin pretty much finishes the duel. Any one of them are going to win it. Pure monsters in our hand, but the duel is over anyway. So, um, yeah, guys, just be patient with Rush Duel. I know you guys don't like it. It doesn't do well, even for my videos normally. So I, I get it, but it's a part of Duel Links. It reminds me of older Duel Links. Once upon a time, Duel Links was this simple, and people from the OCG were saying this about Duel Links like we do about Rush Duel. But just give it some time. Um, the cards aren't quite there yet, but we're getting there slowly but surely, as you can see from this duel. So hope you guys enjoyed, and thanks for watching.